These takeout containers destroying your liver. Hi, I'm Dr. Vinay Patel, triple board certified in internal medicine, endocrinology, and obesity medicine. I'm here to talk to you a little bit more about these endocrine disruptors. So a lot of these plastic containers contain BPAs or PFAs, and these can be really toxic to your liver. And anything that can be toxic to the liver begins to affect your metabolism and then leads to this insulin resistance and actually worsens this diabetes. That's not what we want, is it? So BPA or bisphenol A is in a lot of these plastic containers. So when you're eating these containers, sometimes it leaches into your food and leads to this fatty liver that we all know and dread. The worst is when you microwave these plastics and your food in these plastics and it leaches into it. Don't do that. Bad, bad, bad. Plastic containers obtained before 2012 very likely they have these BPAs. So start looking at your containers. On the bottom, sometimes there's this recycled sign. And in the middle, there's a number. The ones that have one, two, four, or five are unlikely to have BPAs. But some of these companies can be sneaky. Instead of using BPAs, they'll use something very similar that has not been banned yet. Another good tip is making sure that we're microwaving things in glass or ceramic bowls so that it doesn't leach out the plastic and microplastics. Doing this will hopefully help keep your liver strong. And men, keep your tea levels up. So if you like tips like this, or if you have other questions, put them in the comments below. Give us a follow. See you next time.